here we are on a beautiful morning. Uh, I cannot be bothered in the slightest. Just thought, I'm out. This is the longest run that I have completed, or I have yet to complete, since my injury. Uh, I'm doing 4k today, but I mean, that means that after today, the next milestone is doing a 5k again. Uh, and I just, I mean, once I've done a 5k, that just makes me feel like I'm back on track. I'll start slowly introducing field running, hill running, just general trail running. Which I'm very excited for. I mean, you need to take my word for it. <laughs> I feel like I'm not exactly, not exactly seeming like I'm very excited just now, but uh, yeah, I thought I'd just come out for a, a what do you call it, a first light run. Uh, I'm very much in the mindset of just making the most of things just now. Uh, aye, 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 aye. So, just while I'm still here, I thought I'm going to make the most of things. Just get out. As soon as I'm up, nice first light run, and then after work today, I just crack on with things. Hurrah! Can I hold this steady enough to get a shot? Yes, kind of. So for this next video, um, I'm actually going to put in what my plan is, what the plan has been, how I've been training so far uh, through recovery. Yeah, just, I uh, just as a slight overview, I've been doing leg training, trying to do it twice a week, doing like one heavy day, one lighter day, um, doing like knees over toes guy stuff. I'm gonna assume you maybe heard of them. If not, look it up. Great information, great seeming guy, um, would recommend. But anyways, uh, I've done the two, try to do two leg days a week. Um, and then when it comes to running, it's just been slowly but surely up in the distances. Uh, mentioned it in one of the last videos, I think. I did 5k total week distance, 7.5k total week distance, and then this week has been 10k total week distance. Uh, I'm not sure on where I'm going to go from there, but all I do know is it will include a 5k. Uh, excited. I'm not going to touch too much on the subject that I'm referring to, but I think there's going to be certain times in your life where you think maybe, why am I doing this? Who am I doing this for? Um, and it's easy to think with a lot of things that you should be doing it for someone else or trying to prove something to someone else. I don't feel like that's, I don't feel like that's the case, but it's amazing how much we can build these kind of things up in our own head. Um, I think the main thing is doing it for yourself, making sure that you're enjoying it. And I think to make sure that you are enjoying it will make you in turn happier. And if you're happier, it's going to make the people around you happier. And if it's not, well, maybe they're not the people you should be having around you. Um, anyway, regardless though, I think, again, the main thing is, I think we all ask ourselves, like, why? Why am I doing this? Why should I be doing this? I think it all just needs to come back to yourself. And if you can't really find an answer, just say, well, who cares? I want to do it. Just do it. Do it. That was... <laughs> Ah, oh, dear, dear. Anyways, this is just going to be another shorter video. Just getting back in the swing of things. Next video, I'll have more detail. I'll, I'll try to put some more effort into it. I look forward to it. Hope you have a fantastic day.